Senator, I just placed yourself back in uh, some of the freshman shoes uh, back in 2006, I believe it was? That's when I was elected, yes. And, and uh, from then until now, tell me about your impressions of how it's changed to where we are today. Well, when I came to the legislature in 2007, my first session, we were in the, in the minority, and of course I was not expected to win my race, and so uh, I had only afternoon committees, and so it meant that I had my mornings uh, to meet with it, you know, constituents and all of the legislative advocates and all of those. Um, and so it was kind of contentious, but I was learning the ropes at that time. And then, goodness, in 2009, was in the middle of chairing committees and working on education issues and things like that. Um, and I think, you know, in 2015, it was pretty rocky. We were in the minority again. Um, but I think the last two sessions, uh, it has just been phenomenal how it's changed and we're working together. I think a lot of it is because um, for Nevada, we all, you know, Republicans, Democrats, you know, whomever, uh, we want to do what's right for Nevada's family. So on most issues, we agree. And those that uh, we don't, vast majority of the time we do sit down and try to work it out, which is why you see so many amendments on bills. <laughs> As we see the lights go out behind you. Tell me how you're feeling walking out of there tonight. Well, actually, it's really bittersweet because this is my last session and I've thoroughly enjoyed the work that we've done and the people I've met and worked with. And so to no longer be in the state Senate is, you know, it's it's a little tough. And I, you know, it, the waterworks start. <laughs> they didn't let you off easy, though. You had to go until the last minute and 30 mm -hmm. some second, minute 45 seconds to get the weighted funding formula through. Right. So you were on the heavy lift all the way to the end. Yes, I was. I had a, a couple of the bills that we were working on to uh, take care of some of the special projects we wanted to do. And then, of course, at the top of my list was the K the K-12 funding formula. And I think, I don't know what time it was, late this evening or, you know, I don't know when it was, but to run upstairs and testify with the superintendent Ebert just to make sure that we got the message across that uh, this bill was a good bill and the vast majority of it's what Senator Dennis and I and what we were trying to do all along. Um, and so I, it's a, we're in a good place and it's just really, really important that we all keep working together to make sure that uh, we deliver for the students in across our state.